one of these things, man. So what's gonna happen in this scene? Who's getting speared in the head or whatever? Uh, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna be here guarding. Uh, then you're gonna be behind the BMW. Then you're gonna like just race straight up like from the, behind the BMW. And you're walking towards me. And uh. Alright, so uh, why you? What was your inspiration behind "Sexy Babe"? Well, "Sexy Babe" is a song about Helen Keller. Uh, we thought it'd be funny. We thought it'd be offensive. We also think she's very hot. So we wrote a song about all the things we were gonna do to her, slash how she couldn't read or hear. But we also threw in that she didn't have any arms or legs. It's totally fictional. I think I'm not sure. Um, and we thought it was pretty funny. Al came up with uh, the guitar part, and he had on acoustic, I translated it into electric, and uh, everything pretty much flowed, the chorus, seriously. I just played it once, and that's how it was. Um, so I guess you could say I'm the star. <laughs> Have you ever read any Helen Keller stuff? You mean idiot? <laughs> Have I ever read? I don't know much about Helen Keller except that she was sexy. She couldn't write. Helen Keller can't write. So. <laughs> <laughs> I asked him if he wants to give a ride. He's like, I don't know. I'll just see you later, dude. You can tell he is. Like when Adam, you're huge. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What is she? She's gonna be so mad. It was, I mean, it was pretty, I don't know if it was cool or not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna blame. Kind of I don't know if it was, it was kind of cool and kind of really stupid being able to play on that huge stage with all the crazy lights and the that everything jam band. <coughs> but I don't know, it was it was really crazy playing to like six or seven hundred people. The other local bands, who's your like favorite local bands and who's your mm -hmm. least favorite local band? Well, From my personal favorite, Butterfist. Butterfist is, yeah. I like them. From uh, They're kind of like our partner in crime band, I think. We play mm -hmm. most shows with them. Well, a lot, at least. It's our our manager from uh, Taco Bell started it up, and uh, they're just they're they're good. I like them. From Kokomo, like, there's only really two bands that I like. When it's Butterfist and In the Face of War, they're real cool. They help us get on some shows and stuff. <laughs> and they're nice people. Oh oh, Suicide Cop. Yeah, Suicide Cops. Maybe. Which is the dude from Bend the Face, End the Face of War, <laughs> End the Face of War side project, and they're like a punk. They're what about, pretty uh, punk, and they're awesome, but they hardly ever play shows. Have some shows don't they? Yeah, they're from Logan Sport though. Uh, well, they're still local. But yeah, there's a bunch of good bands in Indiana, but the Pokemon like, scene is terrible. Kind Harley of. Poe. Yeah. Oh, Harley Poe. Yeah, they're good. Yeah. They're real good. I thought I'd throw that in there. <laughs> yeah, uh, Harley Poe's sweet because they sing about zombies. And uh, I really like zombies, and because they're all really nice. Yeah. What do you guys think is gonna happen? Um, like, do you guys expect the show tomorrow to be pretty good? I believe Era Anderson. Uh, it depends on how much we like having uh, girl clothes on for a day. Well, I'm pretty excited about it, to be honest. I'm very excited. Be quite frank. I'm I'm pretty excited. Uh, it's in Anderson. I don't. I don't know. We've never played there, but people say the punk scene's good. And it's a drag show. Yeah, which will be. Fun. Good I think it'll. Punk that'll be fun, and I don't know. It'll kind of be like the the music, isn't as important, which sucks. Like Wes said. Uh, but, <coughs> you know, tomorrow we won't even have to look for an excuse for being gay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Woo. You guys. Like the whole day. It is very fun. Good. What do you guys think of like Bloomington, the city? It was sweet. It was cool yeah. as balls. There was, like, was graffiti everywhere. It was the coolest city we've ever, well, I've ever been in in Indiana. 
It's inspired us to stencil up our own town. Dude, don't say that. Because we'll get arrested. <laughs> anyway, well, <laughs> yeah, the, the show was really fun. It was in a basement. Which is, those are like always like most, well, my favorite shows anyway. That was a big joke when Jordan said we were going to stencil up the town. Yeah. <laughs> that was funny though. <laughs> that was a real good joke. Yeah, that was pretty funny. <laughs> but, uh, so, uh, yeah, 